This video we will show you how you can correct colors in your underwater footage. Color correction should not be a substitute for red filters or lighting, but there are cases where you have old clips that are bluish and you want to improve them. So we have made this tutorial for you. We will be discussing two methods, the mobile app Dive Plus and correction using the free video editor KDN Live. Dive Plus is a mobile application available for both Android and iOS. You can download it for free from Google Play or the App Store. The installation should be fast and very simple. Dive Plus also has several functions for planning and logging of your dives. However, for the purpose of this video, we will just focus on the color correction functionality. You can use this app to color correct static photos or videos. If you choose the video option, you can select the footage you want to correct. After hitting the play icon, you will see a preview showing how the app color corrects your footage. It adjusts the white balance, contrast and brightness at the same time. Dive Plus puts its watermark in the videos. If you hit the remove watermark icon, you will be asked to buy a VIP membership. Without this membership, you can only change the position of the watermark. Using the green Adjust Correction button, you can get an option to adjust level of correction you want to perform. When you are happy with the result, just hit the Save button in the top right corner. The corrected video will be saved under a new name generated by the app. As far as I know, Dive Plus is not available for PC or Mac. So for serious video editing, you might consider the following option. KDN Live is a free open source video editor available for Linux, MacOS and other operating systems. You can download it for free from kdnlive.org. Let's see this example of a raw underwater footage of a sea turtle. When you watch the preview pane, you can tell that the footage is too blue. This can be also observed in the RGB parade in the top right corner. You can recognize that the red part is much lower than the green one, while the blue part is the most prevalent. You can improve the colors of the footage by adjusting the white balance. From the effects window, select the effect called White Balance LMS Space and apply it to your clip. Click on the droplet icon and then on a part of the image that has a neutral color. I usually select sand, a coral bed or anything white in the image. In the next step, adjust the color temperature. You can do it either by dragging the slider left and right or you can directly type in a value. This effect is keyframeable, which means you can select keyframes of the clip and set different values for different parts of the video. The next thing you can do to further improve the image is to adjust the contrast using the effect called contrast. Drop the effect onto the clip and adjust its value. Again you have the option to use the slider or type in a number. This effect is also keyframeable. You can also consider adjusting the brightness of the footage. Unsurprisingly, this effect is called brightness. In this case, the original brightness was appropriate, you can remove this effect. When you play back the corrected footage, you can see a major improvement compared to the original. If you look at the RGB parade in the top right corner, you can see that the three colors are now pretty equal. Indeed, you have the freedom to change colors anyhow according to your own preferences. We have shown you only two very simple methods how to improve your underwater videos. Indeed, you can carry out color correction in other tools such as Adobe Premiere Pro. Usually, these tools are not free and the procedures are much more labor intensive. Thanks for watching. If you like our videos, please leave thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel.